Hello guys, my name is Boko. You are watching a short Serbian lesson. Let's try reading and practicing Serbian. The Jovanovic family. Porodica Jovanovic. Father Marko. Mother Anna. Son Milan. Daughter Jelena. The Jovanovic family uh, lives in Niš. Porodica Jovanovic živi u Nišu. It is a city in the south. To je grad na jugu. They have a house near the river Nišava. Imaju kuću blizu reke Nišave. Uh, they have been living there for 15 years. Oni žive tu 15 godina. The father and the mother work. The son is a high school student. The daughter is a college student. Otac i majka rade. Sin je učenik u srednjoj školi, a kćerka je student. Marko Jovanović je farmaceut. Marko Jovanović is a pharmacist. Ana Jovanović je psiholog. Uh, Ana Jovanović is a psychologist. Milan Jovanović je srednjoškolac. Milan Jovanović is a high schooler. Jelena Jovanović je student. Jelena Jovanović is a college student. Uh, where do they work? Gde rade? Marco works in a pharmacy store. Marco radi u apoteci. Anna works in a private clinic. Anna radi u privatnoj klinici. Do Milan and Jelena work? Da li Milan i Jelena rade? No, they don't. Ne, oni ne rade. Words, reči. Family, porodica. Father, otac. Dad, tata. Mother, majka. Mom, mama. Son, sin. Daughter, kćerka. Brother, brat. Sister, sestra. Elementary or high school student, učenik, male, učenica, female. College student, in Serbian we just say student. House, kuća, year, godina. South, jug, near, blizu, river, reka. To live, živeti, to want, želeti, to work, raditi. To learn or study, učiti. High school, srednja škola, pharmacist, farmaceut. Psychologist, psiholog, pharmacy store, apoteka, private clinic, privatna klinika. Ok, let's repeat. Hajde da ponovimo. Who are they? Ko su oni? Where do they live? Gde žive? What do they do? Šta oni rade? Where do they work? Gde rade? Now, can you write about your family? Sada, da li možete napisati o vašoj porodici? What does your mom and dad do? Where do they work? Do you have a brother or a sister? What do they do? What do you do? Now, I would like to uh, give you an exercise uh, that would require some of the knowledge learned in the previous lessons, in my previous videos, about the word order in a sentence, some cases, vocabulary. Uh, if you watched uh, the previous videos, uh, this exercise should be very easy for you. Uh, let's try. Exercise 1, vežba 1. Translate the sentences. Prevedite rečenice. I'll give you around five seconds uh, to try to translate, okay? Number one. Belgrade is in Serbia. So let me help you with the first example. Beograd je u Srbiji. Number two. Moscow is in Russia. Moskva je u Rusiji. 
Athens is in Greece. Athena je u Grčkoj. Tokyo is in Japan. Tokyo je u Japanu. Japan is in Asia. Japan je u Aziji. Is your country in Europe? Da li je tvoja zemlja u Evropi? Who is in the hotel? Ko je u hotelu? Where is the hotel? Gde je hotel? Where does Marco work? And where does Anna work? Gde radi Marco, a gde Anna? Do they study Serbian? Da li oni uče srpski? What does she want to buy in the city? Šta ona želi da kupi u gradu? Are the stores crowded in the morning? Da li je ujutru gužva u prodavnicama? You can see that we use a different word order in this sentence. As I've mentioned before, you can construct sentences in several ways, several different ways in Serbian, and all of them would be grammatically correct. But in this case, this one sounds the best for my ears. And the word gužva is actually a noun in Serbian. It means crowd, a crowd. Uh, students are at colleges. Studenti su na fakultetima. Doctors work at hospitals. Doktori rade u bolnicama. Shop assistants work at stores. Prodavci rade u prodavnicama. Anna works at the clinic. Anna radi na klinici. Marco works in a pharmacy store. Marco radi u apoteci. Milan is a high schooler. Milan je srednjoškolac. They live near the river. Oni žive blizu reke. They live in a house. Oni žive u kući. Alright, perfect. That's it for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you wish to have a live one-on-one -on -one lesson with me, Serbian or English, you can find me on Italki. It's a perfect platform for uh, learning any language in the world. Uh, you'll find the link in the video description. Uh, use it to sign up and uh, also you'll get $10 on your balance after you complete your first lesson there. Uh, so basically you'll get your second lesson for free. Um, you can uh, also connect with me on social media. Uh, you can find me on Facebook and uh, Instagram. Uh, I will see you next time. Take care. Uh, hvala vam puno. Uh, vidimo se. Zdravo.